Where's Brasidas? What do you want with him? We fought together. A friend? Yes, and a friend of Sparta. Now take me to him. Stop! I have orders. Stand guard and wait for reinforcements. They were due two nights ago. You can stop waiting. I've arrived. You? The Athenians are dogs at our throats. You won't talk so tough once you see them. I join you, and all they'll see is the ferryman. Ha! Well met, warrior. You better fight as good as you talk. Come, we go to Brasidas. A bad day for Athens! A glorious day for Sparta! You can't defeat me! Stay focused! They are growing weary! The end is near! between you and me. And it is one you cannot win. If Brasidas dies, his blood is on your hands. He is yours and every one of your friends. Are you mad? We can still stop. Enough! We will not stop. I don't want to kill you, Alexios. But I will stop you. My name is Simos. Ah! 
Continue. One of us will die. Isn't that the point? I found Mate. Finally reunited, only to lose each other again! You're cold-blooded. I would have done the same at Pilos. Of course, that's not the first time you cast me away to die. Huh. So that's what they told you. It's what I know. So what? I'm a prisoner until I'm killed? That's the plan. Or I could come in there and end you anytime I please. But before that, tell me what you know. I thought your cultists told you everything. Sounds like you're on their side, but they're not on yours. You think I'm just a puppet? 
Then prove it to me. Tell me why I'm on the wrong side. Convince me. I dare you. What do you want to know? Everything you claim to be true. But after this, I kill you. Why was I abandoned that night on the mountain? Ask the people who want me dead, who treat you like a fucking god. You dare insult the ones who didn't leave me to die? They were the ones who sent you over that cliff. I gave them victory! They would throw away their champion? Malaka! You're being used. You wouldn't be here with me if you thought they were telling you the whole truth. Here's the truth. If all they wanted was a soldier, there are thousands. They want me, and only me. They want control over everything. The people, Athens, they won't stop. No, they won't stop. I won't let them, and they won't control me. I'm winning this war for them. At what cost? Whatever it takes. Themos. We've been searching for you, and you are here... ...in the gutter. I hear it shouting. It's nothing. Leave! Now! This was not your action to take, boy. Do whatever you want with her. I intend to. Now go. Keep in mind, you put yourself in the cell. I don't recall doing that. You have to understand. This is all for Athens, Cassandra. Pericles would have impoverished the entire city. The people were living in squalor. So you had him murdered? You can't find the perfect yog without breaking some of the quail's eggs. He wasn't right for us. Killing your adversaries proves what kind of leader you are. Oh, I'm just getting started. If only you'd be around to watch. Come into the cell. You're here to kill me, aren't you? Let's see what happens. Fortunately for me, there are other fires I need to extinguish. I have heard word of revolt. Already? That was fast. I have a plan. They can't revolt if they're dead. I don't know how you can take on a band of rebels if you refuse to fight this one. The act itself is out of my hands. The vote has been cast. What did I tell you? The people have given me their blessing. I use their power. That's not democracy. The people have chosen their destiny, Cassandra. They've chosen me. Fuck you, Cleon. <laughs> I'm not alone in this. The people of Athens have spoken without me lifting a finger. That is how you treat rebellion. They don't know what they're agreeing to. You help me in Athens, even willingly. If only you were more like your brother now. A pity. The cult wins, Cassandra. Now, I have to see about the boat heading to Mytilene. Its people are in for a rude awakening. This will be easy! Interesting. Death may be the greatest of human blessings after all. Ah, at least you tried. Surely it's the thought that counts. 
Thank the gods you are alive, Cassandra. If those guards are not the last, I say we need to leave and do so quickly. Wait, we need to talk about Cleon. Socrates is on to that Malacca. We know what he is doing. Be brief. Her equipment, Farnavas. Come, Farnavas. Cassandra, meet us at Pericles' residence. There we'll discuss all we know. The steps to the Parthenon are long and built on corpses. You made it. Of course I did. Varnavas was ready to go after you again. Like he said, it's the thought that counts, right? Apparently. Come, the others are waiting. We were worried you wouldn't make it. Especially with every Athenian guard looking for you. Cleon will have to do more than that to stop me. What's all this? We've begun working on a plan to take down Cleon. Although I hardly call it a plan. Lots of talking, not much action. It feels different without Pericles. But his inspiration lives on. That's why we're here. Where once we gathered to forget our problems, now we meet them head on. And get back to what truly matters to restore Athens to its former glory. So you're taking down Cleon. Tell me the plan. It won't be simple. His death would disrupt the peace and be worse for Athens. He's right. We must discredit him first. Aristophanes apparently has some play he thinks will do the job. Some play? It is so much more than that. Oh, don't get your tunic in a twist. I just don't see why we can't all love each other. It's so much more fun that way. What's so special about the play? With your famous orange ape impression be making an appearance? Ha! Funnily enough, that was the inspiration. Isn't it a risk to show him in a bad light in front of his admirers? I think the play will change their minds. Good art is risky, but my plan will work. We can't just sit around. Cleon is sending a boat to Mytilini to kill the people there. The people trust Cleon. They'll vote for whatever action he puts forth. But that does not mean we plan to do nothing. Taking down Cleon won't be easy. But with your help, it will be possible. Someone needed to stop Cleon. Fools look backwards in times like these. And you're no fool. For now, we work to save Mytilini. So that's what all this is? Some kind of plan? Ever since I heard Cleon speak of Mytilini, I have known something was wrong, and I have been taking steps to find out just what. 
Your plan sounds promising. One of my students is posing as a guard at the Acropolis. Apparently, Cleon is hiding something there and has been meeting others in secret. That's a bold move. Desperate times. If you believe there's something at the Acropolis that'll help, I'll find it. I expect you'll find the proof you need of his offenses. What if the people don't turn against Cleon? They will. I'll be speaking in front of them soon. With your help, we'll show them the man behind the facade. Where do you need me to go? To the western section of the Acropolis Sanctuary. Anything else you can tell me about where to look? What I know is Cleon's always loved the statue of Athena. Sounds like a good place to start. I'll find something at the Acropolis that Cleon won't be able to deny. Good. I'm headed soon to speak in front of the people at the Pelix. If you find anything that can help, meet me there. I'll be quick. This looks like somewhere Cleon would come. Oh, 
Looks like someone dug here. This shovel looks recently used. So to get the key, I need to find the commander Phylos. Muddy tracks. Probably came from someone in the garden. Step closer, eh? You! 
Doing that, he's on our cafebo. Hmm, must have been a bird. This was right. This is exactly what we needed. Good, you're here. The people are waiting for me to speak. You should be able to use this to your advantage. It's what I could find about Cleon. Mytilene is just the first of many places that he wants to wipe out. With the sway he has over the polis, he'd get the votes for death every time. Then it's up to us, right now, to change their minds. So, you'll join me? Talking to the people may not be enough. We need to show them why following Cleon is wrong. I'm surprised to hear you suggest such an idea. Desperate times. Isn't that what you said? So I did. Follow my lead and respond as if you're one of Cleon's supporters, not mine. I'll do my best. But Socrates! Cleon is a man of the people! Tell me, if you harm someone with a sword, are you not responsible? I am! What if you hired someone else to harm another? Are you still responsible for that harm? Yes, I'd still be responsible. You are almost too insightful, and you are completely right. If someone should be hurt by any means, and we play any role in that hurt, we are still responsible. We have agreed that we may harm another, even if not by our own hands. That's right. So, let me ask you another question. Who should you trust? The many, or the one who has more expertise? The majority is always right. And who is informing the majority? I suppose we're following the one at the top. 
And if you found out the person at the top had lied to the people you follow, what would you do? People who lie to me don't deserve my trust. Nor should they. After all, if someone lies to you a single time, what's to say they would not do so again? Yes, you're right. So you agree that someone who lies to you is not worthy of leading? Of course. Oh, Athenians, would you not also agree that you can have responsibility for harming another even through someone else? I would. And would you follow someone you found out had lied to you for their own gain? Of course not. Above all things, therefore, I beg and implore you, hear these words. The one you currently follow is lying for his own gain. Cleon has lied to you in order to get the votes needed to attack Mytilini. And we have the proof that he'll do it again. Should the ship arrive in Mytilini, the people stand no chance of surviving. Now that you know the truth, you can take back your decision. Another vote must be called. The lives of those people are in your hands too. The ship must be stopped. That probably could have gone better, but even so, I believe the people are unable to deny the proof we presented. All we did was talk. What we did was far more. We used proof and clear argument to bring forth an outcome that will not just hurt Cleon, but hopefully save countless lives. But was it enough? I believe word of Cleon's misdeeds will be shared throughout Athens. Its citizens love the city and what it stands for. Nobody wishes for it to fall. It'll be a disaster! A disaster, I tell you! Calm down. What are you talking about? My masterpiece! It will change everything! Amuse, astound, titillate, and open people's eyes to Cleon's machinations! But I need you! I am no actor or poet, Aristophanes. By the gods, no! It's Thespis! My leading man is missing! A play with no star is no play at all! How do you know he's missing? He never misses a rehearsal, unless he's drunk, or with a woman, or a man. Could be anything, then. No, he knows how important this is. He wouldn't let me down. Something must be wrong. You could just get another actor. Oh, no. Thespis always draws a huge crowd for his performances. The more people who experience my blistering indictment of Cleon, the better. So where would I find him? Thespis usually doesn't go far from his home. You'd best start there. This shouldn't take long. Prepare the show, and I'll be back as soon as I find him.
This must be Thespis's house. like an actor, unless you're playing an Athenian guard. I... I... Hush! I'm going to ask some questions, and you're going to answer. But Commander Rexenor... What's your name? Bullis. Well, Bullis, it's your choice whether you walk out of here. Do you understand? Yes. Tell me, what are you looking for? Some stupid play. They don't tell me anything. Play? I just do what I'm told, and they told me to destroy the manuscript. What have you done with Thespis? Some of the boys are meant to keep him drunk in the tavern down the street. You'd better be telling me everything. All I know is they wanted to keep this actor busy. See for yourself, he's at the tavern. You sure, that's all? I just follow the commander's orders. I don't ask questions. I'm sorry, but you can't be trusted to live. Your life ah! ends here! Enough. And what business is it of yours, friend? Yeah, what business? Oh, look at you. You'd best believe you. I'm here for his employer, Aristophanes. So, he's not working now? Yes, he's not working. I like him, though. Aristophanes, funny man. But the opinions told him it's dangerous. That it is. I need him sober and rested. I don't think you understand the situation. Commander Raxenor's orders are he's not to leave. I said I'd stay. Don't want trouble. Give me Thespis, and I'll give you something in return. I'm sure we can come to an arrangement. Here, for your troubles. I'll look after him now. Ha! <laughs> A fool and his drachmi. Very well. You won't see us again. I is not feeling too good. <sighs> he said. You're behind the mask, you'll be perfectly safe, he said. You so strong, Ekaterini. Wee, giddy ups. 
my parents said you'll either be an actor or a drunk. <laughs> I fooled them. I became both. Told him Cleon will kill us all. It's more assaults than satire. The sausage. Thank you, but you can go no further. For I know true love. I just need you ready to perform tomorrow. Of course, and I just need my muse. My love, I can't. I won't perform without her. You will perform. Uh-uh, not without a Caterini. A divine name for a divine body. I mean being. Those men in the tavern, who were they? Oh, the admirers? Harmless, really. And I do like a man in uniform. You need to sober up. This play is important. So is a Caterini. I need my muse. Please. She's just west of here at the House of Aphrodite. If it means you'll do the play, I'll find your muse. Then I will... I sometimes want I will to gather Apollonia my... Uh... Was a good idea. My usual type. Too many muscles. But if you've got a drachmi, we can come to an arrangement. Thespi said I'd find you here. Ah, my darling Thespis, an artist in so many ways. But let's talk about us. I thought you were Thespis's great love. That is love. This is commerce. So, what are you into? No, Thespis wants you to go to him. He needs you to help him perform tomorrow. Thespis does love to perform, but he'll be doing it without me this time. But you're his muse? Commander Rexenor has made it clear. It would cost me my life if I were to associate with Thespis right now. I've been hearing about this Commander Rexenor a lot recently. He's one of Cleon's favorite dogs. I've heard stories from some of the girls. Likes to play dresser, got a fancy robe and mask. Likes to hurt people too. I'm sorry. He runs the local garrison. His men are always here. They tell him in an instant if I was gone. Why would this Commander threaten me? It's all to do with this stupid play. They're doing everything they can to protect Cleon's image. Still, to threaten you? Actors are a superstitious bunch. Commander Actioner knows Thespis won't perform without his muse waiting in the wings. Don't worry. I'll deal with Commander Actioner. You don't understand what a bastard he is. He's more than just some Athenian soldier. What do you mean? Secret meetings, strange visitors. He gives me the creeps. You'll have to kill him. There's no other option. 
If I do this, will you go to Thespis? It would be my pleasure. Don't worry. I'll take care of him. Bring me back his little sword, as proof. I'll be back soon. Let no man be called happy before his death. Till then, he's not happy. Only lucky. There seems little doubt that Rexenor is aligned with the Cult of Cosmos. Is this proof enough of his death? Not quite the sword I meant, but as long as he's dead. My part is done. Go make sure Thespis is at the theater in time for his performance. You are too tense. Come here and lie a while. We've time to have a little fun. Or is it always business with you? Is it with you? So blood does pulse in those veins. It was. But what of Thespis? Thespis is an actor. Half the girls here have been his muse at one time or another.
Now, we need to worry about Thespis and Aristophanes' play. This play is important to you. With it, we hope to make change for the better. I can see there is more in your eyes, but we are all entitled to our secrets. It's enough for you to know that I plan to stop men like Commander Exenor and Cleon. Let me know what you need.
May the blessings of Hermes go with you. Tell me you have news of Thespis? He's fine. And he'll be fit to perform your play tomorrow. Oh, thank the gods! I know what actors can be like. Compared to what I'm used to, it was a breath of fresh air. That is so good to hear. Here, for your troubles. The people may be the heart of Athens, but my play will be its voice. What a pig's education he has had! Such insults! And to think I was going to propose a statue to be erected in the city to each of you for your bravery! See! He treats us like all daughters and crows at our feet to deceive us. But the cunning wherein his power lies shall this time recoil on himself. Ah! Alas! The conspirators are murdering me!
received word that Erbibos is dead. Very interesting. So, what's next? The play was a great success, as I knew it would be. With that and the proof you presented at the Phoenix, Cleon has lost much of his popularity. Now he heads to Amphipolis in an effort to redeem himself. Cassandra! Brasida sent me to find you. He's alive and well. Where is he now? Amphibolis. They're preparing for battle. If you reach him before I do, tell him I'm on the way. So what are you going to do? Brasidas needs my help. I plan on giving it to him. Though should our paths cross, I won't hesitate to kill Cleon. Whatever you decide, remember he's only a man. I can't promise anything. Be safe. Brasidas, you're here. You got my message. I heard about Pilos. Are you all right? I've been through worse. We have bigger problems right now. After Pilos, what happened? The remaining Spartans found me and gave me time to recover. So I did. But your leg... You disappeared from battle. I was captured. Taken to Athens for an interrogation with Demos and Cleon. They didn't kill you? They tried. So, Cleon's in Amphipolis. Somewhere. And in armor, I hear. He'll fight for his life today. He wants to be the hero. Athenians can't think much of him after what he did. This is our chance, Brasidas. We kill Cleon today. If you don't, then I will. There's something you're not telling me. <sighs> I am here for Cleon. Let's keep it at that. I thought we were friends. You're not who I thought you were. You were raised Spartan. You should know how to be loyal. I came here, didn't I? We're fighting the same fight. You haven't proven that. Let me prove it now. We're wasting time. Athens is gathering reinforcements. I... We need to attack now. Let's go. Malaka. Today, we give everything we have. No giving up. The Athenians are here! Spartans, charge! 
Archers on the wall. They need to be shut down now. For Here's where you die. I will drive you into the This is going to be... The Athenian camp is ahead! Destroy it all! I'm watching you! Don't try anything! <gasps> Don't step out of line!
Unfortunately for you, it is. It's not too late, you know. You can still join us. We're not in Athens. You can't talk. Cassandra, come now. Show mercy. You turned him against us. My own brother. We lifted Vimos up. We made him great, unstoppable. You made him a monster! Then fight by his side! Teach him! You would have Themos once again! His name is Alexios! I beg you! This world is severed, Cassandra, and we'll unite it! Shut the fuck up! My hands are empty! Have pity! You will die just as you lived. Uh, as a coward. I'm not through. I won't be forgotten for all I've done. You're not worth the memory. That's it, then. Irini will want to know Cleon is dead. And Vrasidas. I should have gotten to Vimo sooner. I'm sorry, my friend.
My lamb, you've been gone so long. Brasidas is dead. No. They must killed him in battle. And what of my son? Cleon fired an arrow into Demos's back. The wound didn't look fatal. He could still be alive. Malakas, Cleon. I'll kill him with my bare hands. It's done, Mater. I already sent that snake to the sticks. My family. You're all I have left. Mother, there's something I need to do. I need to go to Mount Taietos, where it all began. My whole life has been spent fighting and running. Running from my past, fighting to forget. I can't do this anymore. My heart was shattered on that mountain. I need to put that night behind me, once and for all. I'm coming with you. This is where everything changed. It's like I... Alexios! On the edge of the world, a mother calls out to her child. Touching. Please. You use that name as if it means something to me. It's the name your father and I gave you. Was that before or after you brought me to this mountain to die? It was the cult. I tried to save you. I did everything. The priest told me you were dead. And they told me you abandoned your son. Alexios. Come to me. We are your family. We can go home. Family? Home. <laughs> the cult is my family. The battlefield is my home. I told you, Mother. He's beyond reason. Beyond reason? Is that what you told Mother? Why didn't you tell her the truth? And what truth is that? That I'm the chosen one! I'm the one with a destiny! I will bring order to this world! You're nothing but a mercenary with a broken spear. Me. You are just a tool used by the cult. I'm glad you said that. Since we first met, I've been trying to figure out what you are to me. You're a weed, trying to choke and destroy everything I've planted. 
And you know the best way to kill a weed is at the room. Alexios? When I was little, I found a lion cub trapped in a snare. My friend tried to free it. That's when I heard the deadly growl of its mother. I watched as the lioness tore my friend to bloody shreds. Even in the world of beasts, a family protects its young! I loved you! I still love you. The one you love is dead. My destiny is clear. And I won't let you get in my way. I tried saving you once and it cost me everything. You will not survive the mountain this time. I tried to save you! Stop living in the past, sister! Your death is now! You've hurt this family for the last time! <laughs> but that's where you're wrong. The hurting has only just begun. Disappointing. The spear of Leonidas was wasted on you. Who trained you? Mater? Mater? You should have trained with the cult. Would have made this fight more interesting. Soon you'll be dead, and so will your precious cult.
This is where everything changed. It's like I'm... Alexios! On the edge of the... Alex you used that... The name was... It was... And they took... Alexi, we... Family. The cult. I took... Beyond... And what to... But you're... You don't... I'm glad you're in that. I will... I'll... The one you... I... Tr I tried to save you! Stop living in the past, sister! Uh, Your death is now! Uh, You've hurt this family for the last time! <laughs> but that's where you're wrong! The hurting has only just begun! So disappointing! The spear of Leonidas was wasted on you! Who trained you? Mother? Mother? You should have trained with Colt! You would have made this fight more interesting! Soon you'll be dead, and so will your precious cult! Ugh! 
protect this world. This is nice. Having us all together, I mean. Not all of us. But we have each other.
Diesen Fehler mache ich nie wieder. Well, that wasn't so bad, was it? It'll never be the same. I thought it could, but it'll take some work. It's impossible to see through the gods' eyes. They have a plan, you know. If we could, then we'd know just what to do. I don't think the gods can take credit for this one, Varnavas. An urn is only as strong as its potter, Cassandra. Urns are pretty easy to break. Just remember, no matter who surrounds you, I'll be there. And the others are waiting for us on the ship. Right behind you. Ich hatte eine halbe Sache gemacht, statt Nägel mit Köpfen. Musik 